keyboard is objectively best choice because it can play make any sound you want. So true. That's exactly why I picked it. Multi-talented instrument, you know? Um... Oh! Whoa, look at that! Nice little halftime result right there. Okay. You guys suck. Dad, we're killing it. We're actually killing it. Sending in the the reinforcements. I am the reinforcements. All right, straight to Tricolor. It's on Flounder Heights. I don't know how this is going to be, but we'll see. All right, real game. Let's go. Where am I? I am Defender. Okay. All right, let's see what this map is like. Cool. They can't go around, it seems. You can only go around this way. This is... I mean, it's just high ground you got here, right? Do you not under any circumstance go to Paris? No, I know. I hate Paris. You're carrying team keyboard right now? Dude, I am not on your back. I'm just saying. But I'm glad that you're on the team. <laughs> Dude, it's Dadzilla. Don't ask me. Love the stream. Me and the kids are watching. Can Let's you go. say hi to Chandler and Dylan? What's good, Chandler and Dylan? Hope you guys are doing good and enjoying your Splatfest. And I'm, I hope you guys are on team keyboard because we're going to win. I'm right, dead. Nice. Have you ever been to the United States? Yes. I've probably seen more of the United States than most people who are, that live in the United States right now. You Americans in my chat? Are you guys really even American? Wait, you're not from the USA? I am not from the USA, no. What well, makes me say that? The amount of states I've been to. Even like places, you'll just think like, why? Like, Arkansas. <laughs> you'll just be like, wait, isn't that like a retirement state? And then you'll ask, wait, how does dude know that? <laughs> Keyboard will win. This guy ran out of ink. Probably wouldn't have run out of ink if he wasn't using that haircut. Not gonna lie though. Quick question, what's your opinion on Fizzbangs? Love it. Love it. Nah, it, it changes how tough one plays. It's just like little extra things that you can just throw at people and it just makes people move. So I'm a, I, I am a big fan of it. Doable. I don't know, we might have actually been able to take that. Yeah, no, we did. Hell yeah, dude. He doesn't try color match with me, he was drums. That's insane, dude. How did it feel losing to us? How did it feel? I wanna know how it feels. I hope it feels terrible. <laughs> it's just like borderline psychotic behavior, behavior, you know? It's like, I really wanna know how it feels, how, how you feel about losing to us, you know? Like, <laughs> I need to know the feeling. Something I've known is dude is so chill and I love it. Yeah, man. You know what? Maybe I won't kill you. Wait, experiment. Man, we need... Good stuff. <laughs> I would have done the same thing. Cool. I cannot wait to have hot chocolate tonight. So, okay, I'm gonna tell you the story. I love hot chocolate. I love hot chocolate. Instead of having coffee and like tea, I don't drink tea, I don't drink coffee. I have hot chocolate. And there was this time where I had like, I ordered this Belgian hot chocolate. I was so, so nice. Taste was immaculate. It's just like the perfect kind of chocolate. It goes stupid, honestly. So, I was just like, after that experience, I really wanna try and have like Belgian hot chocolate, but like, on demand, VOD Belgian hot chocolate. I wanted to have that experience. So I bought this uh, this particular Belgian hot chocolate powder, you know, add milk thing. And I had it and like, it's good. But like, you know when like you drink something and it's just like doing a little too much? Like with this like particular hot chocolate, instead of it being like a clear, like nice tasting hot chocolate, like the taste was there, but it was just like too creamy. Like it was just too much. It just felt like it was too much. It didn't feel like a hot chocolate where like, it feels like you're like drinking a really steamy, nice fluid, you know, hot chocolate. I want that kind of experience, like a hot chocolate that's fluid. So my usual hot chocolate is this one hot chocolate that's made in San Francisco. It's like Gradella or Gradelli or something. I have the, like the double hot chocolate and it's amazing. It's like my main hot chocolate that I've, uh, having like if you guys wanted to know a main that i had that particular hot chocolate is like my main hot chocolate and i that ain't gonna change anytime soon however your boy did a science experiment like two or three days ago and this belgian hot chocolate that i bought like maybe like nine months ago what i started doing is i started using one scoop from the belgian hot chocolate and then one scoop of the double hot chocolate gradella thing and then i mixed them together and oh my god 
It's like triple hot chocolate, but it's like less powder. It's like clear. It just like go. It's it's just like fluid. It's it's, it's basically the Belgian hot chocolate that I always wanted. You know, it's amazing. A little science experiment happened, and now I've created one of the best hot chocolates of all time. I'm kind of proud of it. Let me tell you, it's like you know when you eat like a nice chocolate cake, and it's just the out the aftertaste where it's just like, oh my god. Uh, that's a, I read a really nice cake. That's what this hot chocolate tastes like. That's what, well, that's what it's it's like. It's just like it's just so nice. The feeling you have after is just like yes. I just had like the greatest dessert, and it's just like a chill thing that I normally do. So that was my uh, science experiment of hot chocolates. So now I mix a Belgian scoop of hot chocolate, my double hot chocolate, makes triple hot chocolate. It's honestly the best thing of all time. What do you guys think? Give us the re recipe. Actually, you know what? I'll bring it. I'll bring it. Hang on. I'll, I'll get the recipe. All right, guys. I got the recipe here. I got the recipe. So, you got the Belgian hot chocolate. You can see inside it. You got, like, the hot chocolate dust. Very, very nice. It smells amazing, actually. Write this down, guys. You're going to add one of these, all right? You add one of these. And then you add one of these, all right? Add one of these. Double hot chocolate hot cocoa mix, all right? This and this. One teaspoon of each and get your milk, hot chocolate milk, mix them together. You got like the best tasting hot chocolate of all time. You made okay, a video nice. on how you make your cereal, dude. I Can did. Can you also make a video for this ultimate hot triple chocolate drink, please? Oh, 100%. There's metal and chocolate. All right, now I think we're just putting misinformation in chat now. <laughs> Maybe there's iron. Uh, I think there's definitely iron in some capacity in lots of food that you might not think about. It's just kind of how food is when you say metal i'm expecting like a metal bar this is a block of metal you know when i bite into this chocolate i expect to like feel the like the, the solid metal that's like metal nugget in my, my my chocolate you know it's like a like a nut in a, a snickers bar or something you know when sheldon explains weapons you close your eyes i've never read anything sheldon said to be honest do you think we are winning tricolor i think we're the best team ever so it's kind of like inevitable Oh, eventually, but do we not care? I guess we don't care. We're just gonna let them score, I guess, right? Man, we're so relaxed. Do we just feel like we're just gonna win every single game? Maybe is that that's that's like be like, you know what? You know what? Take take it. Just take just take the thing in the middle. Take the ultra signal. We don't care. I mean, I I respect it. That's just how it's gonna be. That's how it's gonna be. Oh, hit him! Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! Okay, cool. All right, I'm banging. I'm throwing the bangers out. Uh, they all chaining it. Alright, green is like absolutely like in the dumps right now. We need to clear drums on this dude. They're doing too much. Am I on drum side? I'm not on drum side. Alright, hang on. We gotta sort this out. I don't like what's happening here. I'm glad, so glad I didn't die there. They are doing way too much here. And then drums, oh, oh my god, I go from one side to the other and now the other side's now starting to pain. What's, what's going on dude? I generally feel like we lost that now. We didn't care enough. The moment I stopped looking at guitar to help the other side, we just didn't care. We have to care. This is serious business here. We can't just be like throwing games like this. You know what? That game could be the difference maker. You have to care. And before Shiver wins by 0.00001%. And then I'm going to bring up this game and I'll be like, this is why we lost. Were you guys looking at this one game that we played where we didn't care? This is why we lost. Now look, we have another chance to make amends with this, all right? We have another chance to make amends. We're going to do it today, all right? In this game, we're going to care. We're going to put all the, we're going to put all the care in the wall in this game, all right? Plus they're throwing, like both teams are throwing. There's like no way we can lose this game because they both have a blast. They can't paint, like they can't paint for themselves. I hate to tell you, but Shiver is rigged. I mean, that's what I'm saying. Look, if Shiver, if Shiver wins, then we absolutely know every single Splatfest ever has been rigged. Cause there's just no way that she wins every single one. There's no way. See, look, look at this guys, caring. See, look, you see that? Care. All right, look guys, this is a, this is a game there's some care here. Oh, wow. That guy lucky is lucky I'm injured. Care? Care? Where's the care, man? Come on. You have to care. Look. Care. Look at that. Care. I can't heal him. Thank you. We gotta push that side now. There we go. That's good. There we go. See? Care. A whole lot more care into that game. Dude, you should stop caring so I can win my first Splatfest. 
Sorry, don't care. I'm going out to win. You should have picked Team Keyboard if that was the case, you know. To the city. Absolutely insane, dude. Oh, God. Don't get me started with Sonic Underground, dude. A seer warns a deadly fate. Give up your children. Separate. Bide your time. Lie in wait, Sonic Underground. You got the disco ball in the middle, dude. Oh my god, Marina's got the keytar. She's on team keyboard as well. I can't believe it. So cool, man.